hello guys welcome to placeopedia hope you all are doing great so let's start with the today's video in today's video i am going to discuss on the accommodation like top 10 questions i i have taken on the accommodation policy of accenture which you people have been asking me repeatedly okay so i thought to let just today's discuss in today's video on this accommodation uh, questions accenture accommodation like okay so whether they will provide it uh, or not accommodation they will provide or not like how many days is there if you want to relocate like how what are the conditions and how many days they will provide the accommodation and what are the amenities they are providing so all these things we are going to discuss in today's video okay so watch the complete video if you want to know if you want to know the know on the accommodation policy of exchangers so okay so whatever the questions i am going to discuss here the answer i have taken from the accenture portal from the recruiters and and my friends okay so watch the complete video and understand the accenture accommodation policy okay so let's just start with the video and see all these 10 questions so let's just discuss one by one okay so first question is like accommodation or the guest house facility is available in accenture or not see if the accommodation or the relocation facility is going to provide to you by accenture then the recruiter is going to discuss with you about this before onboarding only okay and also accommodation thing is going to mention in your offer letter as well if it is mentioned if if it is already discussed with you then you definitely are going to get the accommodation facility on relocation so if it is not mentioned in your offer letter if it is not not discussed with you then you have to contact your recruiter and your hr and you need to discuss about that before getting the facility okay if it is not discussed you cannot make sure that you have have the facility or not so if it is mentioned if it is already discussed then make make sure that the thing is mentioned in your offer letter as acknowledged like you got my point so now the accommodation is provided to you on relocation you want to relocate from your city to different cities so the relocation accommodation is provided to you okay this is confirmed now we have the question like how many days will accommodation be provided okay uh, if your liberty for accommodation has been confirmed by your recruiter so you will be provided complimentary stay of 14 days and 13 day 13 nights okay for this you need to first raise your request with your recruiter you can also refer to your offer letter for further details regarding your eligibility what are they telling and you can if you are eligible for accommodation uh, then you will receive one mail from Accenture regarding your hotel stays and all check-in date and all like that no oh. uh, also you need to raise requests with your recruiter and further details regarding your eligibility what they are telling is you can can if you are eligible for the accommodation uh, if you are eligible then if you are confirmed that you are eligible for that accommodation then you will get for complimentary stay of 14 days and 13 nights okay but that you have to confirm from your recruiter first so if you want to know about the accommodation everything you can also refer to your offer letter also okay so the next question is accommodation provided for 14 days is chargeable or not or accommodation provided 14 days is not chargeable or not like got my point like if you but if you have done any last minute changes okay if you, any ad hoc or last minute, minute changes you have done then you have to arrange you stay by yourself and also you need to claim the reimbursement after that okay but this thing you have to discuss with your recruiter before getting it getting to your onboarding also you need to get, got my point so the next question is is like that what are the amenities provided at the accommodation venue that means like okay, accommodation venue may kya, kya provide the company okay so for this what they are telling is like before joining before you are going to the join 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 the onboarding team then you know uh, onboarding team will share an email regarding your uh, accommodation voucher details three days before your joining and what uh, they are telling is the like onboarding team will going to share you the particular details 
and voucher voucher details for your stay and they are going to share you the voucher recommendation three days and also they will tell you the whole voucher whole details of the accommodation regarding the amenities and other and and other whatever the facilities they are there everything is mentioned in your mail accommodation details so yesterday i have shared one mail regarding accommodation details so you can watch this, that video uh, also okay so the next question is like i am relocating from a different city how much i can claim as relocation expenses when can i claim and what documents are required to claim okay. for this what they have told is you is you to have make sure that you first you have to check whether you are eligible for the accommodation or not like a relocation accommodation whether you are eligible or not they have to check in your offer letter if you are eligible you can claim the reimbursement on the relocation expenses okay so for this uh, what they have told us like uh, you might want to check your offer letter first to be sure that if you are eligible for relocation or not first you make sure that you, once you are not sure you are sure that you are eligible for to claim the reimbursement on mighty portal and expenses and expenses on actuals and payable against your bills up to like up to a maximum amount is, is that is mentioned in your offer letter okay so whatever is mentioned in your offer letter then that you can get it reimbursed or you can claim it remember also you need to remember you will have to submit original bills or flight boarding passes while claiming the amount and you must claim your relocation expenses within three months from your date of joining jo date of joining the new location oh, i think ho hope you got the got my point okay so next question is like uh, transport facility care facility will be available for the accommodation when you are not okay further the answer is i am afraid like you can avail the transport services like only after your onboarding formalities are done like your documents verification and all also you need to reach out to your recruiter to know more details this is like uh, what the answer i got uh, got it okay so the next question is like uh, will accommodation or guest house be close to the work facility like your uh, office so they have they have told us uh, that the hotel help desk will choose the closest venue available from your office location like however if you do due to any reasons and accommodation menu is not available then they will book the next best option okay so the next question is like accommodation be extended beyond 14 days extending your stay beyond 14 days will be treated only on like uh, only on an only on an exception basis like if you may require to consult with your business lead and also you need to take decision accordingly only on this special on the okay, exceptional basis you can extend the accommodation but that you have to discuss with your business lead and your HR partner after the discussion as per the discussion uh, decision it taken it will be it will be done accordingly so the next question is can we vacate the facility even before vacant the facility even before completing 14 days yes yes definitely you can vacate the facility if you if you are willing to switch to any other places like if you have any relatives or if you have any places the, the place when you where you want to switch it you can switch it before 14 days also that is not a problem the next question is that like i have not yet received any accommodation details whom should i reach out if your eligibility for the accommodation has been confirmed by recruiter and and you are you are relocating to a new city or you will be considered for accommodation okay like so for this if you are eligible please drop an email to the onboarding mail mail team mailbox mail ids and i will mention somewhere in this uh, in the description that will i said also so you can reach out to them uh, accommodation uh, if you received any not received any accommodation details anything you can reach out to them if you are unsure or have questions like reach out to your recruiters like what are the the point or comments also they have told us told like your accommodation details will be shared with you two or three days prior to your joining to your date of joining 
okay the next question is like what is the type of accommodation provided by provided to you like it will be completely depend on the eligibility guidelines defined by your entity so you can reach out to your recruiter to know more they have not given any details on this so only they will they have told this is the type of accommodation provided to will be completely depend upon in your entity okay but still you can reach out to your recruiter to know more about the details so okay that's all the questions i have having i hope i have clarified most of your questions in today's video about the relocation accommodation policy of accenture if anything is there if anything you don't know just do let me know in the comment section i can help you out if you want to discuss with me right away then please join our uh, channel membership and one one more thing if you have if you have not subscribed this channel and our channel this placeopedia then please do like share and subscribe our channel it is free it is not costing you anything it's free of course just also uh, you need to just subscribe my channels also uh, and also you need to enable the bell icon so the whatever i have uploaded in any video any new video in the in my channel you will get a notification like that so i will tell you one more thing about that if your stream training is started we have all the materials rega uh, regarding accenture stream trainings like dotnet stream oracle pl sql like uh, testing sap sg sfdc also oracle sibel like that uh, informatica dumps if you want then join our community we will provide you this study materials so guys thanks for watching this video also if you want this material then click on this join button and join our gold golden membership then you will get access to this drive so guys thanks for watching this video please do like share and subscribe our channel and, and hit the bell icon so whenever i can upload new video then you will get notification okay guys thank you so much for watching we will meet you soon bye bye see you soon